So in this particular matchup, I'm really excited to see what's going to happen. This is France's top three versus English top two. We'll see what's going to happen. Right away, right away, Jemeler trying to create some distance with the fireballs. We'll see how exactly how the projectiles interact later on. Eliseo being super patient, creating his traps already with the Z drop, Z drop, um, Galaga. A pair, only one a pair. Really respecting the fact that uh, Jemeler has uh, his combo breaker neutral there. I'm not sure, on the other hand, why uh, Elixir definitely has uh, some sort of uh, Luigi experience because we do have some Luigi players in France. I'm not sure about how many uh, Pac-Man experience uh, Jimler ha has had the opportunity to acquire. Right now, Pac-Man proving a, a solid pick for uh, for uh, French hero Elixir. And the, the bell or the cake or whatever being used in a creative way by Elixiao to try to break the, um, the zoning by uh, Jay Miller covering his uh, potential jumps Wow, and this is so tense Jay Miller is really struggling uh, back in the um, Fogos matchup uh, really had a very horizontal um, confrontation with uh, on the one hand Jay Miller using his uh, fireballs and the other hand obviously uh, Fogos uh, using a lot of uh, Frontiers and uh, Banana Throws uh, but in this matchup wow and this is incredibly smart using the multi-hit property of the tornado to clank uh, with the hydrants and then go and uh, pick uh, Pac-Man where he is that is very close to the top blast zone very good uh, recognition and this time again, very good recognition by Alex Zero, noticing that hey, wait, this uh, this move that just threw there is very punishable. Let me just dash up, smash into you, and close out this stock. Okay, spacing with the fireballs again, jumping into Paxman Hydrant. Again, the down B will nearly take it up. Wow, this is really strong this back, isn't it? Doesn't it? And this time, it's Alexeo's turn to struggle to find his pay thing. But right now, double hit on the Galaga. Two Hydrant. This character has basically no combos off of his normals. But off his projectiles, he gets so much reward. You really need to watch out with these because they have all, all have different patterns and uh, Pac-Man players are so creative you really need to stay super focused on which uh, items they, they pick and uh, which and how they use it um, in the set trying to uh, frame trap him into an air dodge and then kill him with uh, the key of the top neutral air and we'll get hit by the hydrant Jemeler right now having a lot of trouble uh, trying to uh, Punish uh, Pax Ma um, sorry, Alexio's uh, aerial vertical spacing. Uh, he had this uh, this uh, amazing uh, down B, but uh, ever since then he's been hit by a lot of hydrants, and this time will get hit by the hydrant during his up B and will not take. Okay, up smash will not kill. Pac Man being a midweight character. No double jump on Pac Man. And this is, this is the moment when you, you start to think, okay, this is close. Well, actually, I'm sorry, this is close. But this is the time when you need to be super careful and not let the Pac-Man player uh, take on that much percent and two up smashes in a row. What is this? Is this like, I don't, I don't even know, like Luigi or Ma Mario? He should be able to make it back. Oh! And Jay Miller does not recognize the fact that uh, at any point, Alexeo can use his up B and... Um, Get rid of the old uh, uh, the bumper that he left before. Uh, so Jemler did not use his, his own upbeat and just died for it in the saddest way.
that was an insane match. Yeah, there was some action, my man. Uh, in, in especially, especially with the, the hydrant uh, at one point. I the, the, the hydrant stage bike. And did you see the other one, the hydrant being uh, out prioritized by the Luigi Tornado? Like he used the tornado, raised up, clanked with the hydrant, so he didn't care about it at all. And then picked back then, which was right above it, very close to the blah, blah, blah. This was amazing by Jamie. So anyway, Jay Miller still lost this game, uh, so 1 0 deficit going back to uh, Town and City. Mm. Nice pressure on the edge by Jay Miller, he's going to try to cover pretty well. This is different um, coming back in Chen. Okay. It was really nice little smash at the landing. Elixir did it pretty well. I love we just. Whoa, what? whoa, whoa. Just not that punishable, bro. You need to chill out. But. It would have been such a, a huge reward, does not care at all, just drops the Galaga. <laughs> Everything fall into Pac-Man then now. And face more than Wow, him, the read is real. He saw that roll coming from Eliseo from a mile away. Wow, just mashes his uh, C-stick towards that uh, hydrant. You will pay for what you've done to me earlier. Nice hit, hydrant. It is really good at, at just poor shielding all those fireballs. The hydrant again. Oh, and, no, no. Well, oh, oh and Elixir does, does, uh, does not do a drop uh, back here, which would have ended the suck, except if uh, Luigi, um, Jay Miller had gotten a, a misfire. Elixir completely play with the distance between him and Jay Miller. Always just getting a little bit further, you know, when he throws some fireball, just moving. Forward and forward to get stick to him and get some good punish. Again, Jim Miller was caught off guard with no double jump, and this could go. Um, oh, whoa, nice up smash! Obviously, you cannot stand on the hydrant when it's getting destroyed. <laughs> that was really smart, Balix. You unfriendly missed it from quite nothing. Yeah, the apple actually having some huge knockback, and uh, the projectile being so big uh, covers uh, really well the two frame window when you grab the edge. You wait till the last moment. Get the water balloon, really slow item. Now the key. Oh! The hydrant at very close range. The hell trying to set up a trap. You need to be very careful when oh, Pac Man has stage control because he can then create oh, all sorts of traps just like that. Standing up the hydrant, creating a wall between him and Jay Miller, which is then destroyed using the key. What did it? What he tried? And oh! again, again, Jay Miller using the strategy I was talking to you about, using uh, one hit of the down B to uh, nullify the hydrant in the box and just go pick, uh, go pick up Pac-Man very close to the blast zone. Oh, nice, nice match. Actually, I'm not very sure how many characters have these kind of options. Perhaps Bayonetta with a, a multi-hit uh, uh, up B, uh, which is still very safe. But uh, Luigi still has mm. a, a unique option to make up for this vertical spacing. And speaking of unique options, <gasps> Pac-Man has a very safe up B uh, to get out of pressure and combos, just like uh, the Jab can sell that Jim Miller so much loves. Mm, got the bear! Oh, 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 nice one, but uh, Jim Miller just had in, uh, time enough to shield before the, the bell. Nice apple on. Just under the the hydrant, really nice. Try to spray that neutraler, pushing him a little bit in the end of the stage. But nice by Jimmy Le catching the high jump of Elixio, <gasps> trapping him under the stage. But but still got that up. Yeah. Nice trumped to put that back here. But now got the keys. Wow! And okay, this time. Oh my God! Hydrant to key. What a nice combo! Wow. This, uh, this confirm was amazing. The crowd erupted. We, we, can, we could hear, hear it from the other side of um, a soundproof wall. Kind of. <laughs> In you. Oh no, too bad. Oh. A bit of an overcommitting by uh, uh, Jamie Lerb, but does not get punished for it. A big back on the stage. Mm, that was a try. Galaga ready, Galaga shoot, but nope, nice nice job by Jim Miller, just getting him, uh, Pac-Man, to close a bit the distance, nice dash, dash attack. attack. Not sure about uh, how intentional that was, but the hitbox definitely hits high, so... At least, nice catching. Well, very simply catching the Galaga, not getting uh, flustered in yeah. any way. Nice job.
You know, I'm not too sure about uh, uh, th th this way. I know. Oh. Uh, I wasn't too sure about uh, what Gemini did to that poor Hydrant using his uh, up smash. Because apart from selling his uh, his uh, main key move, mm. okay, nice one. Mm, nice reading on the ground. Yeah. Apart from selling his main key move, he's not doing anything because the up smash sends the Hydrant away from where Luigi is facing. Mm. So. This time it worked in his favor though because he turned away around before using it. What? Planks with the okay. key with the front air, I suppose. So, very weird action. Okay, it's your try to get in. But uh, Jimmy, they're making a really great job on this one. Making a good wall once again. Yeah, Catching yeah. the jump. Rushing a bit. Nice job to cover the um, the approach of uh, a cell there time. up smash. Oh, missed the don't be unfortunately. Mm -hmm. And Ixio now, got the old guy got all the bail, unfortunately, throw it. He didn't want it. Yeah, I'm not sure if uh, Elixio really wanted oh! it. Oh! And the orange! And the cherry! No. <laughs> this might actually be. No, okay. Oh. Uh, Jamila being, being very patient, he uh, used his, his down B without his double jump, and then after a he managed to recover. Oh! oh yeah, Paul! Elixio bumping his fist into the air. Well, this was actually Gemini really let himself open with his up smash because it was sad enough not to be able to break the hydrant uh, on the first hit. But anyway, even if it had, he still had himself wide open to uh, an apple to the back. Insane, insane. I love also when uh, Gemini uh, wrecked a lot of those hydrants. Don't let them uh, make their jobs or anything. You don't want to let Alexiao make them. But I love how Alexiao just jump high in the air, you know? Load is natural B like always, but making like once air dodge to stop it, yeah. do it another one to just stay as uh, as long as he can in the air to just get another hydrant to use it once again. Yeah, absolutely. And this is very crucial to have replace Pac-Man well and to wow. Pac-Man in general because uh, as we've seen, um, this is uh, where he gets most of his damage off of uh, traps with the hydrant and then uh, Luigi landing after, uh, when he tries to. Um, Punish his own uh, that jump coming so fast with the dash tag. Oh no, I don't was quite a good idea, but Jimmy Miller react really well that zone B. Oh, oh too and Jimmy Miller dropped it totally. He didn't mash fast enough. This might actually have been the one time where uh, Luigi's down B could have been useful against Pac-Man. Um, the move in itself is used to uh, send you low enough that you cannot recover anymore. But since Pac-Man's recovery, the vertical recovery is so huge. Uh, and he leaves a bumper behind him, it's uh, very hard to use uh, Luigi's uh, down B game against him. But when you're this low, this could have been it. But other, uh, my, um, too bad for Jemler, he actually uh, went too slow and gipped himself in the end. And the bell on the wake up and really missed! Yeah, I've just mistimed it. Nice there. Jimmy trying to space with that there, trying to catch him that up smash, won't happen. Nice Oren on the hydrant. Can he stop the fireball, but still two forwarder. Nice job, just right after it. The hydrant just after the, the four there was really nice also. Let him give. He knows he's gonna stay on chill because he knows like Pac-Man can do multiple uh, hits during one short up. So you know he got to stay on chill, he cannot really punish it out of it. Oh the side B the read is real. Get the bell, this is dangerous, and yes! Oh! Making it bounce just where you're gonna come back and paralyze. And this is this is a, the oh. oh nice up smash, clean up smash, taking off uh, Elixir's first stock. And this is one of the tricks I was talking about earlier. Uh, every Pac-Man player has his own tricks, but uh, in the end, it's still the same character. So you need to know basically everything that he can do, especially with uh, moves uh, that um, that are so important, like the bell, which gives him basically a free kill if he gets a hit. So it's are taking some distance, wanting some new weapon, the Hydra when the Jimmy Lee come to him. Wait a bit, get the key now, jab the bit, nice by Jimmy Lee, getting a throw on front of Not that much a key on Jimmy Lee, right after the range, already the forward air. nice forward smash just behind him. The range once again, full face. I'd run to stop him and nice comeback by Jamie Miller. Really yeah, nice. This could be bad. Oh no, Jamie Miller committed to a down tilt, which was not uh, an option that could have net him a kill anyway. Uh, perhaps he should have waited with a smash or a uh, net B. Nice. Okay, looking very tough here. Yeah. You cannot be too scared of a. Uh oh. So slow but so strong. 
And this is funny because uh, I was uh, yesterday at uh, Voya's place, uh, the Chio, uh, and he happened to house both uh, Elixio and Jemir. And uh, these guys, man, uh, they were training in doubles and they were trolling each other so hard, <laughs> trash talking every second, at every oh, point. That and coin, this is your stock, dude. This could be it. Nice one, nice down B. Tricks him into dropping his shield. Okay. Nice this is so risky if if he lets Alexeo charge. Yes, an apple or perhaps mm. a bell. This could be it for wow. Jemiller. Jemiller making such a great job at recovering and avoiding all the fruits and hydrant and everything with just Alexeo throw on him. Hell? What a good move. That was kind of weird, yeah, that yeah. hydrant. I think he bounced back on the perfect shield like it sometimes does. Uh, reminiscent of melee, but there's no hitbox active anymore. Oh, and the apple, apple will keep the Luigi away. And Elixio, in a very convincing fashion, takes it 3 0 against Gemini. Gemini now has to set up for the third place. Still, an amazing placing uh, in this 128 entrance tournament, Mars 2016.